On September 30th, 2021, Raja Krishna Murthy, the Illinois congressman for the 8th district, made history when he spoke these words from the floor of the U.S. House of Representatives. Madam Speaker, today I rise to join many Hindu faithful in the United States in recognizing the month of October as Hindu Heritage Month. Prior to Krishnamurti's statement, a number of cities and states in the Union had issued similar proclamations. However, this was the first time a sitting member of the U.S. Congress had risen in the chamber of the House of Representatives to recognize the Hindu American diaspora in this manner. Hindu Americans had been waiting for years for some recognition of their outsized contributions to the American society. With Krishnamurti's declaration, it was as if floodgates had opened. City after city, state after state, rose in unison to honor their Hindu American citizenry by issuing similar proclamations. When all was said and done, 20 states of the Union and 36 cities had issued such proclamations. And several U.S. congressmen had made official statements to honor the Hindu American community. Such recognition for any community is unprecedented in its own right. However, what makes it truly unique is to have received such broad-based recognition in the very first year of our endeavor to celebrate our rich heritage as a public event. How did it happen? It certainly was no accident. It was, in fact, the result of the combined efforts of scores of volunteers of the Vishwa Hindu Parishad of America and its partners who had been working for months behind the scenes to make the Hindu Heritage Month a major milestone in the life of the Hindu diaspora. Let's take a moment to enjoy the accolades, but also let's not forget to appreciate the hard work of all the volunteers who have made it all possible. Dhanivad.